welcome to my channel. If you're brand new to my channel, my name's Elizabeth. My channel name is Shy Town Girl. I hope everyone is doing well. It's the weekend. Yay! Us 9 to 5 8 to 4 7 to 3, 6 to 2, so on and so forth. Um, it's the weekend. I have a brand new Dollar Tree haul that I would like to share with all of you as I'm knocking things all over here on my desk already. My goodness. I have so many fun finds to share with all of you. I don't even know where to begin, so I'm just going to begin. All right, I found some more towels, OMG. Stitch and weft, I have to tell you, I can't even begin to count now. I think there's about nine different ones I've found so far, so I'm really thrilled to share these. Here is your tag. Brand name company. These are 28 inches by 16 inches. I'll share the back of the tag with you as well. You're going to get two in a package. These are wonderful. They're so soft. This I thought was just so me. It's not even funny. Dog hair is my glitter. I think many of us pet owners can say that whether it's a dog or a kitty cat. I just think these are adorable. So you get two of them. They both say the same thing. The back sides just have these little squiggles, which I guess maybe they intend to be dog here, but oh, these are the bomb. So I was able to come across, let me see. You get two in a set, so I grabbed one, two, three. I was able to pick up four sets in total, so I was very pleased to find those. And then I found another version now these are also by the same company. Let me show you the tag here. By Stitch and Weft, which is right there. And then there's your backside. These ones here, now I'm not sure what they're gonna show on screen, but they are a dark blue. So you get two of them. The first one says Home Sweet Home. And then your second one is just this plain striped pattern. I'm kind of looks black on screen from where I'm seeing it, but it is a dark blue. So I did find two of those and I grabbed them. And then this one was another one that's so me, it's not even funny. I was able to grab three of these. Again, here is your tag, stitch and weft. There it is. And for us coffee lovers, but first coffee. I was no way gonna snooze on those. They are gonna fly. But then when you flip it over, the other towel, which is just as fun, and also my favorite, but first wine. So there are your two towels in a set that look like that. How adorable, right? So I was able to find a couple of those, so I grabbed those as well. Super bargains, I mean, for the buck and a coin, you just cannot go wrong. All right, so that's pretty much it, I think, in my housewares kind of stuff. A couple of food finds, not really so much food as snacks. Um, I don't remember if I've tried these before or not. I wanna say, don't these taste just like Starburst or Mambas or something like that? Anyways, these are called High Chew, and it almost sounds like you're saying, God bless you, or bless you, High Chew, Hi-chew. All right, so these are 1.94 ounces. It has two different flavors. This one is green apple and mango. Immensely fruity, intensely chewy candy. And it looks like that. These are gluten-free. The next one I found is also by Hi-chew, 1.94 ounces. This one is watermelon and grapefruit, and it says sweet and sour. And last but not least, this one is also 1.94 ounce, and this one is grape and strawberry flavored. So yeah, I'm interested to see what these taste like. Not sure if I've ever tried those or not before. Hmm. Usually if I've tried something and I didn't like it, I'm not really gonna remember it or vice versa. I don't know, it goes both ways. Anyways, <sighs> charms, fluffy stuff, rainbow, Sherbert cotton candy, OMG, and this bag is just like ready to burst. This entire bag is full. So I'm really anxious to jump in here and see what these flavors, because the flavors they're showing, 
it looks like orange lime and strawberry i could be wrong um it doesn't really indicate on here exactly those flavors but at least that's what i'm seeing so i'm interested to give that a try also another great bargain <clears throat> excuse me i hauled a couple of these in the caramel sea salt was it this one nature valley granola this is an 11 ounce bag a big bag but this one is dark chocolate pretzel and peanut what i mean there you can't go wrong here now these are good until august of 2022 however they're sealed you know they're gonna go beyond that date they have to give you that date for specific reasons but there's no reason why these in the bag staying sealed will not stay longer than that because i've kept granola longer than that all right so i think that's really it for foodie kind of stuff except i do want to share this with you so they have all these fun fun kinds of decorating things out right now and i finally found some of the sprinkles to go with the cake mixes and the cupcakes and all the other super fun finds you're finding all right so i did get several of them because i'm all about the decoration stuff because that's just me so these are all going to be 1.5 ounces they're all made by the same company which is twinkle sprinkle mix i love it now um the best way for me to show these to you i think they're going to be like this all right so let's start <clears throat> this first one here is called over the rainbow let me try to get the glare off for you but so here's the name of the company love the packaging how adorable is that packaging right so here's the company and then here is the name of this mix that they're calling it so over the rainbow how cute so these are basically just like non perials i think they're called aren't they they also had over the rainbow now look at this see the mix and then see the little rainbows omg how fun are these going to be on cakes and cupcakes then they had unicorn party oh yeah look at unicorn party so look at the little unicorns and then you have the little spritzes here and there and then you have these little beautiful beautiful pearlescent balls throughout i mean how fun come on so let me show you again unicorn rainbows right okay so moving on I did get a couple doubles, so let me bear with me. This one here is called Frozen Magic, and it's got, you know, the white, the blue, and the purple. Love these names. Let's see, I did get a couple dupes, so I don't want to show you too many. This one here is called Deep Space, and looks like this, and it has all these things to do with space. Uh, that one I showed you. That one I showed you. That one I showed you. Oh, this one here, Spring Breeze, which is like all pink and white crystal, like sugar crystal. Then they had this one, um, which is, it's funny because this says Unicorn Party, but there's no unicorns in it. It's all cupcakes, so I don't know what happened there. It should have been Cupcake Party, but... I'm okay with unicorns too. I, I love them just as equally. But yeah, this mix is, look, see all the little cupcakes right there? And then all the little pearlescent balls. Oh my gosh, so much fun. Then they had these and I, I, I laughed because there's so many different fun things you can do with these. They had eyeballs. So they had a, nine, a 0 0.9 ounce of regular eyeballs. And these are all edible. And then they had large eyeballs. <laughs> so if you're doing like cupcakes or cakes, and you're doing something fun and you need it to have a face well there's your eyes all right so that's really going to do it for that kind of stuff all right a couple new pens what is a dollar tree haul without some new pens from me right these are fun these are by jot and uh these all write in black ink you pop off the cap and then it just writes in black ink but isn't that adorable you have this big pink pom-pom and then there you've got your pretty little flamingo also have this one which is in a purple color but then you have this rainbow on top right there with this fluff ball also writes in black ink this writes in black ink as well i needed to update some of my pens a lot of times 
you know, my pens will sit for two, three years in my holders, and you can only dust them and clean them so many times, and then they just become, like, funky. So sometimes I have to get rid of them depending on how bad they are and if I can save them. So this is kind of a great time with all the school stuff out right now to replace, like, people have pen fetishes like me. Uh, one of my fetishes, anyways. It's a good time to get stuff like that. Then they had this one here, which I thought was really cool. <clears throat> Excuse me. This writes in black ink as well. You just twist it, and the pen pops on the bottom. Last for pens, these are by Ink Optimus, and these are fun uh, colors, but they write really nice too. These are just Dollar Tree brand ones, but you get this um, fine line, and I like these colors because the colors are exactly what is here that you can see on the pens. And I use them for my notebooks and stuff like that. They also have this set of two purple, which you can see it's more of a, a lilac purple and then a darker purple. This one here that's a, like more blue teal right there. <clears throat> that's pretty much it for pens and things like that. I did find some new sticky notes to match all the different things that are out and about right now with the Adore Company, which you're seeing the strawberries and the peaches. So these are little notes. You know, they're like post-it notes that you, you know, peel off and stick. Loving these little candies. How adorable are these? It doesn't really say how many you get in here. I'm going to say you're probably getting about 50 to a package, so but maybe 100 sheets in each, like 50 in each one. But how cute are those? <clears throat> also found these water bottle stickers, which I thought was kind of neat looks like that right there hadn't seen this before i grabbed this over at the they had it hanging out at the checkouts so it says personalized bottles laptops cell phones and things like that back in here i have to stop buying lol stuff the party is done the basket's done i haven't shown you the video yet i have it um but i'm still on this kick of lol stuff um <laughs> I'm, I'm probably just gonna you know see that friend and just say here you know what give these to your daughter um, but I just I can't help myself now I'm on a kick but this is a set of jumbo playing cards and there's all different ones on the back and like I said I, I'm just on that mindset now of every time I see lol I grab it um, so that was funny when I got to the checkout I was like you know I could have put it back I'm like you know what no just keep it and I laughed out loud to myself okay they also had this pen here, which some of these you're finding in plastic containers hanging in the school supplies. And then you're finding containers with them open like this with a tag. They're really the same pen. I, I don't know if it's just a packaging swatch um, mix up or whatever, but I grabbed another one because I saw so much purple and pink on this one. I thought it was cool and they're fun to write with. And they do just pop the cap off. They do write in black ink. So something else to go in my collection of pens. <laughs> Another super cute find were these. And these are the string lights. Now you're going to get 10 to a package. You need to put two AA batteries in these packagings. Just, I don't want to say a warning because who am I? But I'm not a big fan of these. And only because I feel like once you light them up, they're so small. They're pretty, but once you light them up, the lights are so bright, you don't really see what's on the string. Just my opinion. So what you're going to end up doing is you're going to get yourself two AA batteries, and it's going to be going into this container right here. And then when you open this up, this is this really fine wire string. It is so fragile and so delicate. Just make sure when you're unwinding it, do it very carefully you get a little kink and it's not gonna work and they're a pain in the butt so my opinion only is just these are cute by themselves but the lights are so bright and I've done many reviews lighting these up so just my opinion you know I do product reviews and I mention these things for a reason let me be your guinea pig so to speak just food for thought to think about it so anyways you're gonna get 10 of these little lights in a package that's what they mean by the 10 count so i found unicorns these little kitties which match identically to the little kitties pocket notebooks and the little kitty mirrors that they have out right now and i think there's a keychain coming if it's not already there that matches this and last but not least this little set with these pandas which are right 
there's a good shot right there and this is what your packaging looks like found those by the checkouts and found them in a little display in the toy section which was a little weird but what if this is so cute i've seen these before um this is a little phone stand and it's all made out of rubber but you've got this cute little unicorn right there and once you like sit it uh, let me see once you sit it like on the desk right here my desk happens to be this is an all glass desk so kind of everything sticks to it but because this is like rubber it just grabs and goes like i'm pushing it it's going nowhere at all so except all my other stuff is falling over my hat from miss patty but yeah so what you do is i don't have um my phone here right now but if you were to do like a remote i don't know if this would necessarily work or not but you guys get the idea so yeah this was kind of fun and even if you you know what else would work how about um well these are receipts from dollar tree but I, just how about for business cards you know, if you wanted to put some business cards so you could still see the face, that'd be kind of neat. Okay, moving on. <laughs> Just some ideas. They also had this ceramic dish. I have a little spuzz ball on here. Bear with me. And it looks like this. It's a little trinket tray. It is made out of ceramic, so, you know, you got to be careful you don't break it. It's about four inches in length. And just a little something... You know, put it on your desk, put your rings in it, put some trinkets in it, things like that. Saw this patch hanging out by the checkouts, and it's made by Crafter Square. So not sure if that's where it was supposed to be, or maybe someone just plopped it there, but it's an avocado. How cute is that? It's about three inches in height, not quite. It's about two and three quarters. And for those of you that like your avocados, great patch to put on something. Also, I was like, um, hitting up the toy section and uh, I found some little beads and I just thought these were so adorable they're in the shape of a rainbow you've got string here and then all these different types of beads with stars to be able to make something they're saying it's a bracelet bead kit so they're giving you enough to make a couple of bracelets how fun is that cute little gift and then right here is where you snap it to open up the entire lid. I gave all of you a sneak peek of some of these little ice cream cones. Oh my gosh, are these adorable? I really, here I am bitching again, right? I really wish they would have extended it just a little more because it's almost hard to tell it's an ice cream cone, but listen to me, right? They're so cute. So first of all, let's start off with, it's a little fluff ball, okay? Down here, I wasn't really sure what it was at first, it's like a hard plastic, but it's a rubbery plastic, but a very hard plastic. So it's not like you could dig your fingers in them. I don't know if you can hear me flicking it or not. Anyways, then you have this little attached piece here that's kind of got a little bit of give to it. So if you want, you know, needed a little bit of give. And then you have this obviously faux gold tone colored ring here. I would be leery to hang anything heavy on this i think in my opinion this is more of a decorative thing but you do your thing i'll do mine this is by the adore collection which is with all that stuff that's coming out right now with all these little pastel colors and there's other keychains out and about right now i just gave you a little hint but that's as far as i'm going so they have this pretty little purple one well it's more of like a lavender color so i grabbed a couple of those they also, and I'm throwing them on the floor, they also had this really pretty, pretty pink one. They are really adorable. I mean, don't get me wrong. They're cute as heck. They also had this baby blue one. And it looks like that. And last but not least, this very pretty, pretty mint green one like a chocolate chip mint green. How cute are those for backpacks on your purse? A lot of fun going on there. They're really adorable. Also, they have these cute little bracelets I came across as well. You get two in a package. These are so fun. I mean, I ain't no, I ain't no Barbie doll. I ain't no size two, but I can work it, work it, just like those girls do. Okay, I know you guys don't want to hear me sing, but I'm just letting you know that these bracelets fit me 
no problem with lots of room to spare. So just because they say for little girls doesn't mean the big girls can't have fun too. They say BFF on them. I think they're so adorable. You get two in a package. Give one to your friend. Keep them both for yourself. Aren't they fun? They're just fun and that's what it's about. I do have to bend down here for a moment because I'm throwing other bracelets on the ground. Now, the one I just showed you right there on my wrist is a two-piece set. They also had some four-piece sets, four instead of two, and they look like this. Now, this one here is all stretchy. Then you've got this one here, which is a rope design, and then another rope design, and then up here, which is another stretchy one. Look at that pineapple there. Here is your backside. I tried some of these and they fit me as well. The other version I found, let me fix for you. This is so adorable. Look at this and then do you see that little flamingo you got going on there? How cute, right? OMG. I don't care how old you are. As long as you're having fun, that's what it's about. All right, a couple pop snap purses. Yes, I said a pop snap purses. OMG. I found a, a heart and then you have a little thing to hang it from. I found another heart and I'm gonna open one up for all of you, a purple one. And then I found this pink unicorn. So let me open up, of course I'm gonna open up the purple one. So some of them are sealed in plastic. I've seen some that are not sealed in plastic. So I think it's just up to the store and how they wanna put them out. But, oh, these are so cute. All right, look at this. So here is the purse itself. So here you have your plastic hanger. And then up here now, they have it a bit reinforced because you know they have a zipper in here. So let's open the zipper. Nice zipper. There's the inside there. So I'm curious if this actually works. Yeah, you guys hear it? It works. So absolutely, I would give this a thumbs up. So cute. And talk about like, um, how cute would these be to get some of these for Valentine's Day? I know we're not there yet, <laughs> but I'm just saying. And use these, you know, for, oh, uh, these are adorable. Okay, so how fun are these, right? So there's your back, there's your front. They're completely squishable, except for your hook right there. The zipper is completely functional. How fun is that, right? Love them. All right, let's jump. Oh, 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 I almost forgot. OMG. How could I forget? All right, a couple other things I want to share with all of you. So this will be a little bit longer of a Dollar Tree haul. Um, I remember looking for these for years. Years. Man, years. And I could not find them anywhere. Nowhere to be found anywhere. And now they're popping out like belly buttons, I'm telling you. So actually I grabbed four because I'm like, I'm not gonna snooze on these. So I'm actually gonna open one. Maybe I'll open two and share them with all of you. Okay, so there's what it looks like. Unicorn doll blind bags. There's the different ones that you could possibly get. So yeah, we're gonna open it together. You guys always get to see what I don't get to see first. <clears throat> and let's see what we shall find. So there's the top of it. What did we get? These are so adorable. I have several. Oh, look at her. Look at her. How cute is she? Her name. Hold up. Um, I might have taken the packaging and tore her head off. Which one is this? She's got a star on top. This is Jessie. There she is right up there in the corner there she is that's jesse they are so detailed it's amazing here we have another one let's see what we get evidently there's some kind of it says find the gold doll um that would be cool so there's the inside i hope it's not the same but if it is that's okay too life goes on <laughs> I believe it's the same one. That's okay, because you know what happens when that happens? They make you want to 
open another one. Now, if the other one is the same, I'm going to say I'm not going to open any more because I probably got four off the hook that are all the same. So that's another thing you want to think about when you're going to your stores and you're buying multiples. I usually try to get them from different stores if I find them in different stores. Or I don't usually grab the same ones off the shelf at the same time because I think they're going to be the same. Wait, I think we have someone different. Oh, look at that hair. Okay, so this one I took her head off. So I have to go to another package. This is violet oh look at how pretty there she is right there how pretty is she okay you know what i only have one freaking one left Let me see what you guys do to me see what you do to me see see the trouble the trouble all right let me try to open this bag a little bit better because i feel like well what's happening is when i take this open as i'm ripping half of what i'm trying to show you off all right you guys what's in there What's in there? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, look, OMG, this is Kate. Oh man, I would so, there she is. Look at her, OMG. I would have to say if I had to pick one, that would be the one like off the back of the packaging I would pick because look at all she's got going on in a bag of chips wow isn't she pretty so yeah lots of fun going on with those um if you see them grab them because they fly so quickly because of people like me <laughs> all right couple other things i want to share with all of you before i wrap this up freeman flirty feet Woo! cracked heel toe relief treatment i finally found some of this everybody was hauling it and i'm like why am i not finding it this stuff is so good 3.4 fluid ounces i ended up getting two of these because these are so much more than a buck and a coin anywhere else and they do work really really well <clears throat> couple things for the car <clears throat> excuse me brand name refresh your car vent clips i found one in strawberry and i found one in cool breeze so i grabbed one of each for some of the cars around the house last thing i found here which is makeup related and i did get a couple because i thought these were so pretty this is the new nyx love in florence it is a five set palette you've got three up here two down here look at those colors omg i did grab a couple of them because i thought they were oh so pretty i love those colors especially that one right there is really really pretty all right everybody until next time i'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up I'm still trying to catch up on videos. I'm not sure you should be seeing this video either. I think it, it'll come on Friday. Um, if not, don't hold me to it. Until next time, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Any questions or comments, hit me up down below. Until next time, bye for now.